Before starting a titration, it's important to rinse your burette to make sure that it's clean and that your titrant solution isn't contaminated. To do this, take a small volume of your titrant solution and beaker, pour it into the burette, and use that volume to rinse the burette itself. You want to open up the stopcock, let some of the solution drain out, as well as tilting the burette to drain it down the sides to rinse the edges of the burette completely. Now you'll want to do this more than once, probably two to three times at least. This video only demonstrates it being done twice, but you'll see we pour in another small volume, probably about five to ten milliliters, open up the stopcock and allow solution to drain. At this point you'll also want to look to see if there's any air bubbles beneath, in the tip of the burette beneath the stopcock. If there are, add more titrant solution and the pressure of the fluid flowing down will push the air bubbles out of the tip of the burette. Doing this two or three times will clean your burette properly and allow for accurate titrations.